I think um, obviously with the situation with Sheffield Wednesday being above us in the league, then it's an important game for us. Um, I think a lot of people are talking about is it sort of season defining. I think it's it's going to be a big burn on things, but I'm not sure that um, it's season defining. You know, I think if we win it, then it puts us closer to our goal. If we lose it, then obviously it puts us considerably further for our goal, which makes it a hell of a lot more difficult. Um, but there's still a lot of games to be played. But um, it's certainly an important game. There's no questions about that. It's, it's going to be really important, though. You know, so I don't want to. Uh, underestimate the importance of this game because it is a massive game for us. But like you say, I think there's a lot of football to be played. Um, most of the top teams in the league have still to play each other. So, um, however, I think we need to go there and we need to make sure we try and come away with the points. They'll be aware that we are chasing them um, and they want to keep that distance at least. And we obviously know that we want to try and get as high up the league as quickly as we can. Yeah, I, th I listen to think every team's sort of had their peaks and troughs throughout the season. You know, I think Sheffield Wednesday have been no different. Um, Fulham are another team who have been sort of really hot um, or went off the boil a little bit. So um, I think it's going to be determining who puts a run together between now and the end of the season as to who's going to have the best opportunity to get in there. Um, and this, this game, obviously, they started that, so we need to make sure we run it. They play with, well, Sometimes we have four up front and the way they play, they, they, they go back to front sometimes. Um, but they've got good players at the top end of the pitch and you're going to have to keep them quiet. I think we, we understand the importance of it, you know, the lads do. Um, and we want to make sure that we go, and, we go and put a good performance in and win the game. And listen, there's no questions, we're capable. It's just about doing it on the day. Yeah, he's making good progress, but um, as always, we, when you're working, we like sort of it's a bone that's the problem that's on it. Um, it's just healing time, basically. So it's how long it takes to heal. As soon as that's healed, we're good to go and we can get his fitness levels back up. So he's been doing a bit of work, but nothing too strenuous at the moment. Yeah, Yusuf's the same. You know, he's been um, doing some running. Um, so we're hoping to try and build his fitness over the next week. Graham's in a similar type boat, to be honest. You know, we're, we're getting uh, some of the players closer to fitness, which is good. So does his... When you're dealing with a ligament, particularly a knee ligament, it's, it's quite similar in the fact that it's, it's got to have healed properly for him before he can really step up his rehab. So he's doing a lot of work at the moment, but we can't really do a lot of turn, change in direction just now because the, the ligament's not stable as it needs to be.